Africans are afraid. The drug vaccine could be another ploy to bring down their population, reduce them. The National Primary Healthcare Development Agency earlier today announced the arrival of the long-expected COVAS AstraZeneca Oxford COVID-19 vaccine in Nigeria. The agency on its social media page announced that the first batch landed at the Nnamdi International Airport in Abuja at about 11.30 a.m. on Tuesday, the 2nd of March 2021, and urged Nigerians to register on its official website to secure a date and time for the vaccination. The post reads, In the first phase of the vaccination, healthcare workers, frontline workers, that includes the military, police, oil and gas workers, Nigerians are the border post and strategic leaders will be prioritized. Reactions consequently trailed the announcement. Many commended the effort of the health agency saying it is a step in the right direction and expressed readiness to take the vaccine. Uh, I don't see anything wrong in taking the vaccine because uh, we, when you look at what happened last year, we stayed at home for a very long time and uh, if, if there will be a cure, a long-lasting cure. Why not? We have to take it and, and be safe so that our our lives will go on, our economy will start running and um, we, we our projections will be met for the year and beyond. The, the other countries, like country in Europe, are also adopting it now. So the, the COVID-19 itself is a deadly disease. So it was in days. Everybody should embrace it. Everybody should to, to, to adopt it. So it's, it's, it's is a sickness that the World Health Organization has, has prescribed to be deadly and it's, it's killing people everywhere. So even, it's, even though it's not that massive in Africa, but to, to, for the African country to adopt it, it's very nice. Mikuma I'm, I agree to, to take the vaccine as well. Uh, Africans are afraid the drug vaccine could be another ploy to bring down their population, reduce them. Others, however, appear unexcited despite assurances by the health agency on the vaccine's safety. Who will take it? Where COVID-19? Federal government has analyzed that we should be taking Ogogogo as a call, everything. Now they get COVID-19 and then they go ever and ever they could get them. Nothing like COVID-19 nothing like COVID for our own place. Now they get money and then they go carry and come and then they go carry that barrier and go. Yeah, now they go, that barrier now for them. Now them, they don't face anything where they happen for this country. They are facing COVID-19. What is COVID-19? Because the fear is we don't even believe in the government any longer. We are not sure if the one they will give the masses is really genuine. So I'm scared. I don't want to take it. Ah, uh, for me, I would not like to take it. Ah, uh, because I really don't know what it's made of. So it's better for me to take what I know about instead of taking what I do not know. So let's not bring side effects that will not hinder. I don't know yet, honestly, to be um, frank. I don't know if I'll take it. Because considering the speed at which the vaccine was made, um, it cannot really be certified that in the long term it won't have any challenge, you understand? So I don't really know if I will or not. Recall that President Mohamed Buhari, Vice President Yemi Usibajo and other prominent Nigerians are expected to take their vaccine shot on live television as a means to reassure Nigerians of its safety.